evening my yam the weather have changed so my yam is drying back so they haven't formed properly so i have to come now and overwinter it so i'm just gonna put some dirt in this one so i can overwinter the yam indoors so i'm just gonna take the stick out the weather have changed guys so i'm gonna take some dirt out of here this is a very loose dirt so i'm gonna just take some dirt and then I'm going to show the stage that the yam is at shortly. I'm just going to put some dirt in this one here. And then I can show you exactly what's happening. So I'm going to move away the dirt. And then to see if there's any yam. I doubt there's any yam, guys, because it was too wet. Wet and cold. I think I can feel a little piece of yam forming. So if I overwinter it and continue to grow it until next year. I'm sure I'll be able to get a piece of yam. So let's see guys, let's see what's happening. So I'm gonna dig in now around the yam where the yam was and see if there's anything. So it's all drying back, it's too cold. So let's see guys. So <laughs> you can see you can see the yam forming guys you can see the yam right there so yes the yam was growing but it was too too cold so there's the yam the yam was forming nicely so i'm going to let it continue to grow in this container here because it's now super super cold so just gonna fill this container up and i'm gonna stick back a yam in there so if only we had a longer season guys you can see the yam starting to form from there up until there so I'm just going to stick it back right in here. And then I'm going to take it somewhere nice and warm. Okay, you can see it's drying back all the way. Nice and warm. I see if there's anything else in here. I doubt it very much. But I just dig around and see if there's anything else in there. No, there's nothing else in there. The yam was just forming. And then I have to go. So that was the white yam, was it? Yeah, this was a white yam. So I'm going to go over here to the yellow yam. And I'm going to overwinter it in this container as well. So, so yes guys, the yam was growing. But, you know, with UK weather. Let's see what's in here. I can take these sticks out. This one have more greenery. As you can see. Have more greenery on it. But it's not going to survive because the temperatures are dipping. You can see it's dying off. So I'm just going to dig around and see what inside here looks like. Let's see guys. What do you think? you think there's anything in this one? I don't think you have enough growing season guys. Let's see. What's going on with this yam? Oh, look a yam was forming. Look a yam was forming guys. There's look a yam. There's not enough time. So I'm going to put it back right in here. The yam was forming. But I just didn't have enough time for the yam. So I'm going to put it back right in there. And hopefully by next, next spring, comes back around, it can continue to grow. It's just a pity that the season is not long enough here. But you can see there was um, yam forming on both of them. So probably if I had this in the polytunnel, where I could extend the season then it would have been okay so at the moment I'm going to take it off and just put some more dirt in here so it can continue to grow it's a shame and hopefully next year we have some nice yam so I'm just going to let it continue to grow on guys I'm not going to destroy it so those are the two yam that I'm going to overwinter just like that. So that's my two yams. So the white yam and the yellow yam is inside here. And I'm just going to let them continue to grow on. So that's the update on my yam growing here in the UK. Until next time, thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye. Share, subscribe, and click the notification bell.